Back now on ABC 15 News at 4. If you've ever had a child suffer an allergic reaction, you know how scary it can be. Yeah, oftentimes you don't really know what's going on. Right. And right now there's a big push in Arizona schools to prevent these kinds of attacks. ABC 15 Susan Casper explains a new state law putting EpiPens at your child's fingertips. I feel a little bit scared on the bus. That's because this precocious third grader is gravely allergic to peanuts. So if I have a reaction and I can't really talk, I just show him this and I flip it over. I felt devastated because I'm the one that gave it to her. Jacqueline Everhart's mother remembers the first time she fed her then 18-month-old peanut butter. I gave her a quarter of a teaspoon. Put her down for a nap and coughing, hacking, wheezing, went upstairs. By then, her eyes were swollen shut. One, two, three. Now, eight and a half years old, Jacqueline knows exactly what to do if she goes into anaphylactic shock. In these situations, time is of the essence. Superintendent of Public Instruction John Hoopenthal helped pass a new law here in Arizona requiring all public schools stock epipins like Jacqueline's to help stop severe allergic reactions. If they see a situation where an allergic reaction is unfolding, they need to act. They have it set up here at school. She has a peanut allergy table that is sterilized. It's cleaned separately. Be very careful. All of Jacqueline's teachers and classmates here at Weinberg Elementary in Gilbert know to keep peanuts out of her path. In Gilbert, Susan Casper, ABC 15 News. Well, state officials say the new law was put in place to protect school personnel from liability. Yeah, and of course, given the state's nursing shortage, that's also a problem. So parents are really being asked to be very proactive and talk to your child's school about any allergies.